Long ago, powerful beings fought a desperate civil war across the galaxy. The noble Arnor and the evil Dreadlords fought to within inches of final victory for the Dreadlords. And then suddenly, they vanished. Their departure opened the door to the younger civilizations to make their way into the galaxy. But their progress was slow, for their ability to move great distances was limited by the Stargates. The Stargates could only send ships between any two of them. The rise of the youngest race, humanity, on Earth in the 22nd century led to a discovery that would shatter the interstellar balance. Hyperdrive. With this technology, ships could travel great distances on their own. Now, the younger races have found themselves in a race to explore, expand, colonize, and ultimately conquer the galaxy. But as they will soon learn, there are far worse things in the universe than each other. All right, well, uh, I still had some static with my last episode right at about an, an hour and 25 minutes to an hour and 30 minutes. I'm still working on that, trying to figure out what's causing that. So, uh, anybody continuing to watch the series on YouTube, I, I continue to apologize for that. I'm trying to figure out what's causing it. And I will, until I get that figured out and fixed, I will continue to edit that out. So, let's continue going. Okay, it looks like we're in last place here. <laughs> We're yeah, we're in seventh place, so that's not not good. We got we've got to um, we got to try to catch up with the other with the other civilizations here. We've got forty six weeks to get the extra capital. Let's pull this up right here. Okay. Uh, yeah, I've got to. I've got to keep focusing on our technology and trying to get our fleet built. Um, it's just a balancing act between constructing um, and exploring and researching <laughs> and just not wasting any time. But we're about, let's see, we're about four weeks away from getting industrial theory, which is going to improve our industrial output so and we're about to get us another uh, constructor built so let's keep working on that uh oh the dominion of core have uncovered a precursor artifact uh oh the Dominion of Core have, have discovered something from the Precursor species that is going to really greatly enhance their culture. Make them pretty, um, pretty powerful. They want me to give them 92? Uh, no. I'm going to reject that. I'm not giving you any money. I... You are... You're neutral towards me anyway. The Phelan Empire is just downright hostile. Now, I keep giving them money, and they just keep becoming hostile to me. I don't know what to do to make them happy. I've just got, I've got to get prepared, because it's only a matter of time before they declare, they're going to declare war against me. Building a Phoenix fighter there. We're building a Phoenix fighter there. We've just got to try and make progress here. Let's keep burning through some time. Uh, Luxor has built a research center. Let's go see. 
Okay, and now they're working on soil enhancements. So, yeah, they're enhancing this tile right here so that they can they can build something else. Okay, very good. I've got to get this constructor. Okay, they're building a research center. Now let me go over here. I've got this constructor right here that is in place. Move it right about. Yeah, let's just leave it where it is. Let's construct a influence star base. Let's see what that did for us. Okay, that moved our influence out just a little bit. That brought that brought Sparta back up under our cultural influence, so that's good. I'm gonna have to beef up this. Gonna have to beef this thing up. Yeah, I'm gonna have to beef it up and get some improvements on it there. How are we doing on Sparta, by the way? We're upgrading research centers. And we're doing some soil enhancement. That's fine. Let them continue to work on that. We're one week away from getting our industrial capability upgraded. Yep, that's what we want. Let's see now. Oh, I really would, do, would like to get that antimatter power plant, but that's 53 weeks. I cannot devote time to that I just can't I can't devote resources to that right now oh what do we need next what is hyper mainframes it helps our research um what is planetary defense that increases our soldiering yeah, I need to I need to go ahead and devote a little time to that. We've got to upgrade our soldiers and try and keep up with the other civilizations. So if they inv invade us, our soldiers will be able to defend our planets a little bit better. Just a little bit better. Okay. You got any modules? You've got two modules available. What can you build right there? Yes, let's do an advanced starbase factory, please. And let's construct another Phoenix. Ooh, a Phoenix Mark III. The Phoenix Mark III do for us. I'm not sure, but I'm going to go ahead and, and build one of them. We'll continue building Phoenix fighters and, uh, and constructors there. We'll just kind of switch back and forth between the Phoenix fighters and the constructors. What are we building? We're one week away from having a Phoenix fighter in Luxor. What are we doing in Valhalla up here? We're upgrading this research center. Just got to continue to let them do what they're doing up there. And hope that the Thalens don't invade me. Burn away some turns here. Get our planetary defense down. Research center completed on hope. They're building another research center, so that's very good. Finish this other... Eight weeks. Okay, I'm just going to let Luxor continue building Phoenix Fighters. And they're upgrading their factories now, which is good, so let's let them continue to do that. Oh, the Dringans are showing up now on my map here. Let me see. They don't have any ships. 
Where's my exploration vessel? He's way up here. He has come through Dringan space. What do they have on their ships? Oh, they're doing mass drivers. I'm going to need armor. The Dringans are focusing on mass drive. They have three. I'm going to need armor. If I get into a war with the Dringans, I'm going to need armor for them. So if I fight the Thalans, the Thalans are specializing in laser weapons and energy weapons, so I'm going to need shields. If I get into a war with the Dringans, I'm going to need armor. Hey, what's going on there, John? Good to have you, man. Just doing a little uh, Galactic Civilizations here, an old game. To have you joining in with me, man. Okay, let me double check my diplomacy here. The Dringans are wary of me. It's the Thalans that are downright hostile to me. They're the ones that I'm really worried about. So I'm, I've got to be more worried about them right now. So I've got to keep, keep focusing on my shield technology. Keep working on our shield technology. There's Eden. Shinzao. What are we doing on Eden? We're upgrading our research facilities there. Okay. Let's continue burning through some time. We've got seven weeks to get our planetary defense research. That will upgrade our soldiers. Period of xenophobia seems to be ebbing as cultural exchange centers throughout the galaxy are reporting a renewed interest in learning about the ideas and lifestyles of other cultures. And okay, I hope that helps me. I hope that helps me with the Thalans. Okay. Research center is done on Earth. We've completed another Phoenix fighter here on Nineveh. Yeah, let's just let them continue to build Phoenix fighters there. What are they building planet side on Nineveh? They're upgrading they're upgrading this advanced factory right here. Okay, great. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. That will be fine. Don't need that anymore. We've got to get this planetary defense researched. Keep burning through some time. Uh, Olympia finished the research center. They're now uh, building an advanced factory. So that's fine. Let them continue to do that. Let's get this research done. We've built another Phoenix fighter on Earth. Okay. Let's build a constructor. I could build a transport. I don't think I need to transport any population at this time all of my colonies seem to be doing fine on their yeah let's just build a constructor all my planets seem to be doing fine with population so i don't need to transfer any population yet i'm happy with that for now um uh, okay what's my little miner doing is he where are you at miner there you are I need you to come over here and upgrade. You go ahead and get back on there. Got a Phoenix fighter here at Luxor. You go ahead and, and defend Luxor. And we've already looked at that. We've got two Phoenix fighters back here on Earth. So we will let them stay there. We're four weeks away from upgrading our soldiers. Let's continue researching that. Okay, our diplomacy is going to improve by 1% because of something that our exploratory ship has discovered. I'm not that worried about the Dringans. The Dringans are a pretty good distance away from me. They're way up here in the northern part of the galaxy. They're a good distance away from me right now, so.
That class six planet is still available right there. I just, I can't devote resources to that right now. I just can't. Okay, this planet is back under the under the cultural control of the Altarans. I'm going to have to upgrade my diplo diplomatic capabilities or something here. Or I'm going to have to build another... I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Let's, let's just build a constructor here. 80 weeks for a constructor? Really? Golly, that's just crazy. Ah, I need it, though. I've got to have it. We've got to upgrade this influence star base here. Okay, let's keep burning through time. We're three weeks away from the planetary defense, uh, defense upgrade. Advanced factory built on Nineveh. Let's go look at Nineveh. Go look at Nineveh and see what they're doing. Okay. Got to... got a research center what do they need do I want to make this a political capital Don't know yet. Let me look and see what else, who what other about Persis. Persis doesn't have the space. About Olympia. Olympia doesn't have the space. Political capital. What's that do for me if I make a political capital? That's a particular planet as our political capital. It doubles its cultural influence. Boy, Eden should probably be my political capital. And if it doubles its influence, that will help Sparta over here. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna build the political capital here on Eden. Yeah, I'm gonna put that there. We're just going to have to build it when we get to it. I got a long list of things I'm building here. <laughs> I'll get you when I get you, pal. Yeah. Okay. Two weeks till we get planetary defense upgrade. Let's keep plugging away at that. We're still... Yeah, we're still in seventh place. We, we're way behind. We are so far behind. Olympia has finished the advanced factory. Check on them. They're not going to be able to do anything until we get habitat improvement here. And we can improve this tile. All we can really do is just improve existing structures. Yeah, we're just going to have to improve existing structures here on Olympia. That's fine. That's fine. One week away from improving our soldiers. Let's definitely get that done. Our survey team has discovered an abandoned colony ship, and we get a thousand credits for that. Wonderful. That means that I can... Okay, we got planetary defense. Very good.
beam weapon theory is going to take 24 turns. Hmm, that's really, I really need that, but I can't, I can't devote that much time to research on that right now. I can't re, I can't devote time to that right now. Let's do hyper mainframes. That will, that will boost our research a little bit. Help us with that. Do hyper mainframes. And let's check on our construction back here on Earth. What are we working on right now? We're two weeks away from getting that constructor. Okay, everybody's still upgrading research centers, which is only going to help our research even faster. Got our constructor on Earth, and we're, yeah, let's check that out. Let's get our constructor launched here. Launch the constructor, and let's go upgrade this economy starbase right here and get some more factories up and running for us. Yes, let's get let's get an advanced starbase factory that's going to help our production on Earth, and it's going to help our production on Olympia. Yeah, that's helping everybody. Okay, I don't need a social. Okay, we'll keep that balance there. What am I doing here on Persis? Persis is doing soil enhancement. Right there. I really need them to build another... What do we want them to do? We could really use some more research right now. Build a research center, please. And let's, let's bump that up in... All right, John. All right, John. Glad you dropped in and checked in on me, buddy. I appreciate that. Good to hear from you again, man. Talk to you later, buddy. We'll have to do some uh, space engineers here soon. Okay. Let's see now. And we've got a new Phoenix fighter on Olympia. So very good. Very good. How is my miner, my little miner doing? He's he's improving he's improving those mining facilities, which is what we want. Let's keep building constructors here on Earth for now. Keep working on these constructors and we're three weeks away from getting hyper mainframes, which is gonna help. Okay, Nineveh has built another Phoenix fighter. Here's Nineveh right here. They've got three now, so let's go ahead and send one of these somewhere else. Let's send one back over here to our mining star base and help protect that mining star base there. Okay. And let's burn, let's keep burning through some time here. Oh, I know what I need to do. I, need, I know what I need to do. We've got a spy available. Uh, let's see. Let's put this spy with the Dringans for sure. Because we know we're going to have problems with them. And let's go ahead and see if we can... see if we can get these Thalens to be a little bit more friendly to us. I've got plenty of money in the bank here. Let's see how he feels when I give him 700 credits. Is that going to make him a little happier with me? How about an economic treaty, pal? Still not enough for an economic treaty. 
Let's see if that can get them off being so hostile towards us. Just not good. Okay, I need you to build a factory here. Let's build an older factory. Just build a traditional factory for now. Yeah, let's build a traditional factory and then we'll upgrade it later. I just want some kind of production being done here. Let's bring that up. Okay. It's going to take 18 weeks. How about if I just buy it? What's that going to cost me? 200 Okay, I'll accept that. I'll accept that. In fact, I think I'm going to queue up another one. Queue up a traditional factory. Yeah. Okay. We're one week away from getting the hyper mainframes, which is going to help our research just a little bit more. Hyper mainframes perfected. Very good. Stellar cartog. What? Our sensors allow us to see stars throughout the galaxy, but not necessarily planets. Huh. Well, I didn't really ask for that, but I'll take it. I will take it. Okay, I guess we can work on our deflectors to help us defensively against the Thalans here in case they do attack us. Let's go ahead and devote only four weeks to, to upgrading our, our, our uh, shields. What we're doing on Sparta here. Traditional factory going here. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now, where is my exploration vessel, Al? You're way up here. Okay. He's still exploring. Where are you going next, pal? Coming over here. Okay. All right, then. Well, we've got four weeks to get our shields improved a little bit. Let's burn through some time on that. We built another Phoenix fighter. That's very nice. We've just about got fighter coverage on all of our planets. Two weeks away from getting this next constructor. Okay, let's let's turn these two guys here into a fleet. Create a fleet there. I'm gonna have to improve my logistics so I can get more ships into a fleet. I'm kind of limited right now as to what my miner doing. He's done, isn't he? Okay, I want you to Upgrade that next, please. Let's keep burning through time here. Our intrepid explorers have discovered a treasure trove that gives us 100 credits. Okay, well, I'll take that. We got our new constructor done. Where'd that constructor go? 
Here it is, right here. Okay, I'm going to do one more economy star base here in the home sector, and then I'm going to do a military star base. So let's do one more e economy star base that has all of our planets in, in, in it. Put you right there, okay? And you guard the star base. You go back into Valhalla. Guard Valhalla. How's Valhalla doing here? Let's bring this factory up here and make that our priority. Get that factory upgraded, please. Needs to be our priority. Ooh, the galaxy's starting to look like a busy place here. And everybody else is doing so well, and I'm not doing very well. God, I gave the Thalans so much money, and they are still hostile toward me. I just don't know what to do. Uh, make them any more happy. I'm just going to have to, to um, prepare for war. That's all I can do. It's just prepare for war. How are we looking at Sparta? We're 16 weeks away from getting a constructor there. I really need that constructor. Bump that up in... Okay, one week away from getting our enhanced deflectors. Our espionage with the Dringens is improving. Enhanced deflectors are perfected. Well, that opens up a lot of things that we can build. Okay, let's work on trade. That's important. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, our planets are still making progress, and we've got a new design available. We now have shield points of two. Our shields are improved on our ship. So now I should have a Phoenix, Phoenix Mark III doesn't have the improved shields. But the Defender does. Defender Mark III does, but the Phoenix doesn't. That's, I don't like that at all. Okay, we're going to have to move up to doing Defenders here. Okay, the Phoenix, the Phoenix Mark III, that Phoenix Mark III doesn't though. This Phoenix does. Okay, I'm a little confused between these Phoenix Mark III's that we've got going on here. Okay, let's build one more economy star base here. And then we'll build a military star base to help protect all of it here in the home sector. That's going to be important. We're about to get another Phoenix fighter here. Okay. We got another 100 credits from our explorers, which is very good. And we've got some Phoenix fighters that have been completed. Now, I want to make sure that you've got the... Yeah, you've got shields of two and uh, laser power of two. Now, that's not bad. That is not bad at all. We need to start upgrading these Mark IIs to Mark Threes. OK. 
Okay. And then we build some down here in Olympia as well. Yeah, let's just keep them there for now. We're three weeks away from getting trade. Okay, we've moved up now. We're now in, in rank number five. We're, we're, we're actually moving up. We're making progress here. We're making progress. We've come up two ranks. So I'm, I'm glad of that. Let's go to Nineveh. Okay, so we've got plenty of ships in Nineveh. Let's launch you and let's send you... Where do we want to send you to? Let's send you up here to Hope. Go on up there at Hope and help defend Hope. I'm going to have to get some logistics after I after I research trade. We're going to have to do some research into logistics so we can include include more ships into our fleets and eventually we're going to have to get start building capital ships. We've got to research all that first. Okay, the loyalty of our citizens will improve by 1%. That's good. Our CNs are paying tribute to the Thalans. Everybody's paying tribute to the Thalans right now. Trade perfected. Okay, that, increase, that increases our diplomacy as well, and it gives us some trade routes that we can open up. So that's nice to know. Okay, I need to improve my logistics here. What will improve my logistics? Oh, it's going to take 16 weeks. I can't. Got to have that. I got to be able to get at least three or four fighters together in one. Okay, I've got to devote time to it. I don't have any choice. I've got to. Luxor. Thalen Empire declared war on the Scotlings, which is a minor race. I need to go to Luxor and see what's going on in Luxor. Okay. Luxor is not... They've got a bad approval rating. What can we do here? What do we need to build here? We can build hypercomputers. 68 weeks. I need that. I need those on one of my larger planets. Economic capital increases income. I don't need that here either. Uh, let's give them a, I guess we'll just give them a market center for now. Yeah. And I need to build a transport here because they're not happy. We've got to get some of this. 21 weeks for a transport. We're going to have to get some of the population, excess population off this planet. So we're going to build a transport to do that. Valhalla, what's Valhalla doing? Station complex. What's one of my other larger planets? There's Sparta. Eden. Eden is going to do the political capital. What else can I? There's Earth. Luxor. 
Nineveh. I guess Nineveh's going to have to get it. Nineveh's going to have to get the... Nineveh's going to have to have the hypercomputers. They will build that here. They've got room for it. Where do I want the economic capital at? I guess that's going to have to be on Earth, isn't it? It's going to have to be Earth. Yeah, gonna have to build that here. Okay. Man, the galaxy's starting to look very, very crowded all of a sudden. How are we doing on Earth? We're we're one week away from getting our constructor. Okay, now I've got to bump up my research right here because I'm doing something that's that's a long shot. And I get that down to 10 weeks. I can get it down to 11 weeks. 61%. Ah. It's not good. Hold on just a second, everybody. Okay, sorry about that, folks. I'm back. Had a quick phone call I had to take there. Okay, well, that gets us down. I get, well, my income is suffering right now, and my approval rating is suffering. I'm going to have to start devoting some time to, to improving my approval rating. I'm going to have to to definitely invest some time into that. Let's try to put a few more turns into these enhanced logistics and get some of that accomplished. I don't think I'm going to be able to devote the full 11 weeks to that, but I'm going to try and get at least some of the weeks, some of the uh, research done for it. Well, the Thalens are looking so strong up here. 
Ah, they're looking strong. And Sparta is back under the influence of Altaria over here. That's not good. I've got to get that. I'm going to have to just go ahead and buy this ship right here. If I buy it now, it's going to cost me 300 credits. I've got to. I've got to go ahead and get that ship done. Burn through a little more time here. Constructor on Earth and the constructor is built on Sparta. Okay. Our Earth constructor, let's launch it. And let's send it up here to this economy starbase. Yes, and I want to build a starbase factory. And over here at Sparta, I want to launch... I want to launch this constructor, please. Let's build an interstellar embassy there. That's going to increase our... It's going to cost me 100. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, that helped. That helped a lot right there. Boy, that really bumped out our influence a lot. In fact, we brought we've brought this other... Altarian uh, planet under our influence now. Boy, that really bumped our influence out right there. That's amazing. And I need to definitely keep in, in, uh, increasing our influence from Sparta, from Eden here as well. Yeah, we got to continue to work on that. Okay, we've already taken care of those two things. I'm going to put a couple of more weeks into enhanced logistics, and then I'm going to try and research something that's going to help with my with my approval rating. Probably some kind of entertainment. Survey team has discovered an archive of legendary stories from ancient civilizations. This will improve the loyalty by 1%. Well, that helps a little bit. Thalians are fighting against this minor race right here at this in this uh, planet. Yeah, the Thalians are going to be coming after me soon. I've got to be, just keep keep getting prepared for them. One more week on enhanced logistics. We're, we're losing mining facilities to the Thalans. So annoying. Okay. Um, I've got to change my research here. We've got enhanced logistics down to eight weeks. Let's do... Entertainment. That'll increase morale of our citizens by 15%. That will help. Yeah, let's put some time into that. Put a little time into that. Bring my research rate down just a little bit. Keep burning through some time here. More mining bases are changing their Ooh. boy, it's getting getting busy and crowded over here quick in our little corner of the galaxy. Getting very busy and crowded. Keep working on Xeno Entertainment, see if that can improve our Approval ratings. Luxor is not building anything right now, and Eden is not building anything. Let's go check on Luxor real quick. What are they doing? They can't do anything here until we get uh, habitat improvement. Can they upgrade that? I want to upgrade that. How do I upgrade that? I upgrade that by building a, yeah. 
Yeah, that's right. That's how we upgrade that. So, yeah, let's upgrade that marketplace. That's what we can do right there. Go ahead and let them work on the political capital. Get some time put into the political capital there. It's going to take 80 weeks. We're on. Okay, we've got to get that done. And we've got a Phoenix fighter built at Olympia here. Oh, what about what is our space miner doing there? I want the space miner. Space miner is supposed to be out here. Let's launch the space miner. You get over here. I'm having to babysit that space miner, and I'm not liking that at all. Not liking that. Send you over there. Going to try to disperse these Phoenix fighters out to some of our other planets and help defend them. Burn through some time and try to get our Xeno Entertainment done here. We've got one, we're one week away from that. Scouts report that a strange wormhole has opened up and unleashed a strange energy burst into our galaxy. We do not understand what the precise effects are. Empire one, of course. Well, fine then. Well, we're falling back down again. We're back. We're down into sixth place. We were up to fifth place. We're falling in the rankings. Well, that's not good. Not good at all. Okay. Uh, we just built our latest constructor. Let me launch that. And let's send it back over here to our newest economic star base. And let's build that advanced star base factory. How are we doing on Earth? We're not doing well. They're not very happy on Earth. They've got a 48% approval rating. That's hurting me. Get these factories upgraded before we continue doing the... Yeah, let's get these factories upgraded, please. Then we'll get back to work on the manufacturing capital. Well, they're not happy on Earth, so let's build let's build a transport. It'll take eight weeks. 
let's build a transport that will offload some of the the um, excess population and that will get the uh, get them happy again there's the Alterans flagship right there how are we doing on Olympia Olympia is hanging in there they're hanging in there they're building fighters for me what about Persis what's Persis doing they don't have a star base they're about to upgrade a research lab Let's upgrade this market center right here, too. And then they're going to do some soil enhancement. I really got to let them do their soil enhancements. Okay. Let's burn through some more time here. Get a couple of more weeks on the logistics. Yep, that's fine. That's fine. Got a logistics down to six weeks. Let's focus on something else real quick. That's important. We're going to have to do some miniature. Let's get some of the easy stuff done. That's going to help us. Yeah, let's get some. Let's get a couple of the easy things done here. Okay, he's done there. Where can I send you next? Let me send you over here to Nineveh. Go help them with their mining facilities. They need to get their mining bases upgraded. So go on over there and help them. Our miner. Ooh, we're getting definitely getting some more Phoenix fighters completed here. Very good, very good. Nineveh has finished some, and Olympia has finished some. Let's look at... Okay, you go... You go on up here to Valhalla and help them out. minor races uh, as long as they don't declare war on me that's all I got to say about that don't declare war on me how are the Dringans looking what are their ships looking like they've got a defender yeah they're still pushing the mass driver so I'm gonna have to put some time into armor plating for my ships. 
in case I go to war with the Dringans, I'll be able to defend myself against them. Now, what about the what about the Altarians? What are they what are they focusing on with their ships? They're doing mass drivers too. Okay, so I definitely want to go with some armor here. Looks like they're going with mass driver technology. Yeah, I'm going to have to start focusing on armor. Just in case I go to war with some of these other races. Okay, we've got our transport done. Well, we're down to 44% approval rating in here right now. It's 44% approval rating right up here. Now watch what happens when I launch this transport ship. Uh, over here in this other sector. Let's park this transport over here in the Kristen sec sector. But let's go back to Earth. <laughs> has built a multimedia center let's go check out luxor okay that helped them out a lot with their approval rating i have got to get habitat improvement though okay and olympia has finished another phoenix fighter and it's the Phoenix Fighter. Let's launch that Phoenix Fighter and let's send that one over here to Eden. We need to start protecting Eden. Does anybody need population? No, but Sparta definitely needs a, fa a farm. Just realize they don't have a farm. Yeah. Okay, let's keep burning through time here. We're almost done with our logistics upgrade. Get that logistics upgrade. We need that. Okay, Earth is continuing to upgrade their factories. Shenzhou is doing a research center. Let me go to Shenzhou and see how that looks. We're upgrading this research center here. Let's go ahead and upgrade this market center as well. And that's done. Okay. One week away from enhanced logistics. Great. That adds us 12 more points to our logistics, so we should now be able to get plenty of ships or at least fighter ships into a into a fleet. A let's improve our sensors. That's important. We're still down in number six, rank number six. We're not at the very bottom, but we're awfully close to the bottom. Awfully, awfully close to the bottom. Awfully, awfully close to the bottom. 
through some time here. Transport on Luxor. Okay, very good. Very good. Let's let's go to Luxor. Where are you at, Luxor? That yeah, there's Luxor right there. Let's go to planet side. Okay. So they oh they've got a 57% approval rate. Oh, that's because we just completed this. Well, I guess I didn't need to build that transport there, did I? I just improved their entertainment, so everybody's really happy on this planet right now. But they are at their population max. So let's go ahead and launch this transport. Let's launch the transport. And we'll send that transport down here to the Cassirius sector to just use its sensors. And we don't want to build another transport there anymore. Let's build something different. Let's build... How long does it take? A, you can build a constructor in 14 weeks. Let's do that. Build a constructor there. And let's get some economy star bases going up here in these in this sector. Get through a little more time here. Multimedia Center finished on Hope. Okay, everybody's pretty happy on Hope now because of that Multimedia Center that I just built right there. This needs to be my research capital why can I not build my research capital yeah technolo technology capital that's what we want let's build that here yeah it's going to take 100 weeks but you know we're going to pass 100 weeks one way or the other so might as well go ahead and pass them Okay, is this on, where is this at, on Earth? Okay, let's launch. Yeah, let's launch this latest constructor from Earth. I'm going to put it right here in the middle, and we're going to build a, we're going to construct a military star base here that's going to greatly enhance any ships that we have in this sector. Yeah, I just want you to stand guard right there with that transport. Okay, have you already upgraded that mining facility? Go over here and upgrade this mining facility, please. For Nineveh there. Yeah. Okay, what are these Altaran constructors doing? What are they doing? Not sure what they're up to. Change him to building some constructors. I think we've got enough Phoenix fighters built for the moment. We've got plenty of Phoenix fighters. We'll build some more of them in a little while if we need to. One week out from getting our sensors uh, upgraded. Very good. Sensors are looking better. What does medicine do for me? I don't need population growth. <laughs> I just don't need population growth. What I do need is armor theory because I need to be able to defend against the weapons of the Dringians and the uh, Altarians. We definitely need to focus some time on armor theory. Yeah, let's definitely get the armor theory done. Okay, we've got a transport there. I'm going to put him on guard mode there, and he can just kind of be my eyes and ears in that area. We'll just use we'll use his sensors to kind of see what's going on around there. 
Do we have any other planets that are at their max capacity for population? Earth is back down to 45% approval rating. I'm going to have to transport some of them away. Zhao. Chung Zhao needs a farm pretty bad. Probably use a factory as well. They have no. Let's do a basic traditional factory. Can I just buy that? Yeah, I'll just go ahead and buy that. That should help their production production capabilities. Speed things up a little bit. Uh, they're happy, so I don't need to transport off any population from there. They're happy. Everybody's happy, except Valhalla's not happy. Let me send an... I'll, I'll build an empty transport, and I'll send an empty transport to Valhalla. Three weeks away from a constructor on Earth. Let's just burn through a little time here. Got another Phoenix on Nineveh. Phoenix fighter on Nineveh. Where are you at, Nineveh? You're way down here. Let's get you to start building some constructors. You've built enough Phoenix fighters. We need some constructors over there. Work on your economy. Fighter on Nineveh. About Earth. Okay, I think our... Okay, he's improving. Put you on guard mode. Yeah, I guess that's everything. Burn through another week here. me in the stream i apologize about the static but I, I can tell from my cursor blinking and my twitch studio mic is just going all over the place that i'm about to start getting some static here and i don't want to put anybody through that so i'm going to go ahead and finish the stream at this point here and i appreciate everybody for hanging out with me at twitch and those that do kind of follow my little series here with galactic civilizations i appreciate it and I will try and get this uploaded to um, to YouTube here to, tonight or tomorrow. And we'll, we'll get it rolling. I wish I could play longer with this game. But after I play about an hour and 15 to 20 minutes, I start getting some terrible audio static. So I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, call a quit to the stream now.
Okay, goodbye, everybody.